You are watching the Big Dog Post Game Show, brought to you by Viner Four Gates and the Big Dog himself, Rick Jacklich at the Jacklich Law Group. Homewood Field today as Maryland is falling to Michigan in the Big Ten Championship. This is a big dog post game show. Bruce, what'd you see out there today? I don't think we've ever done a post game show before a game was over before. <laughs> but this is one I said the way I said, let's just get this thing over with. I will tell you this they got beat bad 14 to 5. Just it, it seemed like they were flat. But they scored one goal in the second half so far. There's a couple minutes left. And the defense improved in the second half, but they were thoroughly dominated by Michigan. Very similar to the first game, Wayne, except a little bit worse. Would you agree? It's a little bit worse. Maryland's offense looks stuck in the mud most of the day. Uh, coming in, I was impressed by how fast Maryland looked on their feet. The, the wittier irks of the movement replace the great passing from last year. Suddenly Maryland looked at, at times elegant in scoring. Boy, not today, Bruce. Uh, yeah. I don't know what Michigan's doing to make the offense look so inept. I, I don't know what Michigan did to look so fast. I spent the first half on the fields, and Michigan looked at least a half a step faster than Maryland for most of that. Michigan came here, and I, unfortunately, I talked with Wayne before the series started, and mm -hmm. I said, I'm telling you, Michigan's on fire, and to come out and beat Penn State and then to beat Maryland. Since 1991, Viner Forgates has completed thousands of projects across the D.C. metro area and around the globe. Use Viner Forgates for your next IT project. For your next IT project, call Viner Forgates at 301-251-2900 or on the web at vinerforgates.com. What well, was before that, Bruce? Yeah, it was yeah, way before yeah, that. You said that uh, you thought that Michigan was going to win the Big Ten. Right, and I also thought that the win over Hopkins took a lot of juice out of Maryland. It was a big win for them. Okay, and uh, uh, something not good for Maryland just happened. Yeah, it was a save for the goalie. It's now two minutes left. Wait, but I'm going to remind everybody about something I told you. In 2010 or 11, Tillman's first year, they had a game at the end of the year against Colgate. This was before there was any conference championships, which has never been in the ACC. And they'll start to have it next year, and Maryland just got whopped by Colby in the final game. And yet, they turned it around when the tournament started. They had to go on the road. We might have to go on the road, I doubt it, but we might. And they won the next three games and wound up losing the UVA in the championship game. So, hope is not lost, despair is not there. And uh, in 10 days, we're gonna play a game, or eight days from today, or seven days. A week from today, we right. be back at it. And it might be a home game, it might not. It might not, but look, before we wrap this up, Michigan was really good. Yes. This isn't that Maryland lost the game, Michigan beat Maryland. Uh, you have a pretty good relationship with uh, Connery. Did, did they do anything special? Well, they kept, well, the last game they drew out uh, uh, Maycar, right. but, but congratulations uh, to Michigan. We're gonna get some video of them winning this thing and mobbing the goalie and we will be back either college park or someplace else next weekend as maryland's quest to get back to the final four and be and continue to be the national champion continues don't give up hope i promise you this is over and remember we are still national champions as of this moment right now. it is this all is, right buddy. all right uh good afternoon and thanks for watching the big dog post game show